You know, I was just thinking that society was generally progressing along well and things were trending upwards overall. So let's go ahead and ruin that by inventing the smartphone in mad smartphone tycoon. Create the iPhone. Company name. What are we called? Do we name it after a fruit for hilarious iPhone joke? Let's name it. Uh... I mean, Ben Quadraneros company is not a bad name for a company. What's like the worst possible fruit that you would not want your phone to be named after? How about the Tim Apple company? Because Tim Apple runs Apple these days. Let's call it Crapple. Oh, dude. The Crapple company. <laughs> Don't be discouraged if you go bankrupt. Congratulations, you're established. Wazda QE can rotate. The lower corner shows the current time. Company fans, company funds, research points, funding, sales. Click the R&D button to start developing the phone. Let's use the, uh, the Snoop Dreon 400. Sounds pretty good. Any memory? Oh, we gotta get some memory too. Let's have crappy memory that sucks. Uh, gotta have that ROM. Speaker, no speaker. Our phone will have no speaker. This is our revolutionary new hardware. SD card, gotta have the SD card. Battery, gotta have the battery. It can't charge. It doesn't have a touch screen. Earphone jack? Yeah, put the earphone jack in there. All right, develop a phone. Wait, I didn't research any of this stuff, did I? I should research more, but who cares? Building a phone is a fun part of this, probably. Yeah, I have one option for everything. That's good. Unlock method, password, earphone jack. I, 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 I should research my stuff first. But I won't. We're gonna immediately. We're going to market immediately. Immediately going to market. Let's make an abomination. Made truly the worst. <laughs> yes. This is called the floppy diskette. It's our all new advanced technology. Horizontal back curvature. I mean, gotta make it curve, right? Ooh, look at the taper. We're going for a cube though. Border roundness. Oh no, it's not, it's not an app, it's a floppy disk. Ooh, look at that, sharp edges. Looks kind of like a refrigerator now. Front camera position. Oh, perfect. We can put it, we can put some greebles on the front for floppy disk goodness. Rear camera. <laughs> it's got my. <laughs> yes. The Ben Quadraderos digital computer game released in 1999 to coincide with the Phantom Menace. Looks like the 2DS with one screen, it kind of does. Logo size, uh, 1 million percent. There we go, perfect. That's what you need for sure. Uh, colors, you know it's gotta be that blue. We're going for a save icon vibe. Made that gray. Ooh, it can be stylish. Maybe like Rodeo Beige. <laughs> Maybe serrate them. Yeah, sharpen the edges a little bit. People are always saying, I can't use my iPad while I'm cooking because I'll get weird crap all over the screen. Well, now the screen is your knife. Our newest innovation. All right, start development. This phone is called... I mean, the Crapple one's pretty good. Slogan, make a friend, made for enthusiasts, ultra display, supper energy, capture your beauty, bigger than bigger, ultra slim, far ahead. I like supper energy. Phone type, elderly phone, elderly phone, rugged phone, beautiful phone, camera phone, media phone, gaming phone, business flagship, gotta, gotta go elderly phone. The Crapple One, start development on Crapple One. The top right corner shows some stuff. 
All right, Dennis Reed. Listen up, Cinti Asset Pack people. Use your Windows XP. This this guy's Googling. Look at that. He's searching for Reddit answers, how to make a phone. Make my elderly phone. Throw a dart at the dartboard for productivity. That's how we can be more productive, I think. How much coins do I have? I'm in severe debt. Okay, that's good. Go back to the, uh, 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 how do I go back to the, uh, there we go. Do we source from a Foxconn sweatshop? Oh, you know it. If they ever research how we're manufacturing the crap from when we're done for. Let's hope nobody writes an expose on the labor conditions of our factories. Honestly, not doing too bad. For, th for three people to launch a smartphone, that's not terrible. Also, I love how I've played so many of these Cinti games that I already know that exact stock chart. I've seen that stock chart in like every game. Oh, very bad. Ordinary. Okay, advantage none, shortcoming, configuration doesn't match phone type. Overall rating, Crapple 1 does not have any configurations that elderly phone should have. As an ultra low mobile phone, the average score expected to be achieved is 30, and the average score of Crapple 1 is 14. The score of Crapple 1 is very low. The selling price of 330 is similar to a mobile phone with the same configuration. Low quality and no price advantage. Not recommended to buy. Start selling. Marquez Brownlee did not like my phone, I guess. Unfortunate. <laughs> the people at our factories wish they were at Foxconn, yeah. We make Foxconn look like heaven. The research for processor Snoop Dragon has been completed. Oh, I could have made my phone way better by just waiting for the research. How do I get more funding? How do I convince a venture capitalist to give me a million dollars for nothing? And we only have 163 fans. Who's buying this? Finance. Give me some finances. Let's see. Who's, who's doing the best? Samsung, Appel, Suni, Notarola, HCT, LJ, Gioni, Xiaomi, Vo, Whiteberry, One Minus, Smart Titan, Transition. Nokia, Voda, Crapple. Aw, oh, Crapple has no profit, dude. Crapple's got no profit at all. Crapple's sucking. <laughs> Crapple 1, this is Crapple actual. How copy? Uh, copy that Crapple 1. We're advertising our phone over. Let's do uh, shopping mall. <laughs> shopping mall banners. Yeah, put a, put a big sign in the mall. That's what we're missing is a mall sign. If we had a mall, things would work out great. My goal is to get a thousand fans. And currently I'm approaching bankruptcy at a rapid rate. I was trying to make a good phone. Let's make a phone that's actually good. I have some new researching developments. We have one gigabyte of storage on our new phone. What is this? I don't know what this is. Is this what it should be? Here is the popular appearance of the phone. Oh, if you oh, if you copy that phone, you get rewards. Okay, so the, the popular phone is iPhone. What was the iPhone that was like the cheap iPhone that was plastic? Which one was that? I like that one. I like phones that like the default case is a color. I don't like it when it's just like black or gray. It's so boring. Wow, navy blue. Daring today, aren't we? I gotta copy that appearance, so we gotta go with like that, and then we gotta we gotta bevel the crap out of it. Middle frame roundness. It doesn't have any of that, does it? No. It's longer though. Doesn't have a rear camera? What the heck? It has no rear camera? What were they thinking? 
All right, where's our camera going? Our camera's going. Right there, I guess. Yeah, this phone appears to not have a rear camera, which is weird. Not sure how that's the ideal. What is this? Camera container? Roundness container? Oh dear. We don't need that. All we need is the Quadraneros phone. That's all we really need. Uh, the color is like a sea foam. It's pretty close, right? That's about that's about right on the money, I'd say. What's that uh, code? Is there a copy paste? C4F2DO. Remember the name of that astromech droid. C4 F2DO. C4 F2DO. Oh, but that's why does it look way brighter on the front? Why is the front brighter? Is that just a lighting glitch or is it not matching? I think it's the, the lighting, I think it's a glare. Can I adjust the lighting setup somehow? To make it less reflective, maybe? Maybe it's too reflective? Put the camera in his mouth, that's a good idea. Rear camera goes right in Ben Quadraneros's. Maybe it should go in his eye. Maybe he either has a robot eye. And there's a camera container, whatever that means. Oh, it's like a that thing. I don't want one of those things. Those things suck. Yeah, perfect. His signature eyeball camera. The metallic slider? Ah, there you go. I didn't see that before. Uh, the back panel also has to have the same color. So, C4F2DO. I mean, I basically copied the hit style, right? That's a pretty good copy. Our hardware is trash, but who cares about that? Is Are those stars being dynamically adjusted based on how close I'm getting? They are, okay. So how am I not close to the color? What the heck? I'm like right on the color. Oh, the front panel's black, duh. There's your problem. Okay, but I'm still only like three stars. How is that possible? Power button black, maybe? Volume button's black, maybe? Is it, does the metallic matter that much for the star? Okay, yeah, that does matter. So maybe smoothless and metallic should be maxed out for everything? I thought I was gonna play a business tycoon, not a puzzle sim. Might be the Ben Quadraneros logo, what, you think so? Oh, here we go. No smoothness on the back panel. All right, logo. Does the logo affect it at all? I think the logo might not have no effect. Yeah, the logo has no effect. It's just for fun. <laughs> Chinese electronic simulator? Yeah, really. Can you make a clone of the iPhone simulator? This is a clone popular electronic simulator. The Crapple 2. Uh, it's going to be make a friend. Phone type, it is a budget phone, I'd say, right? It's a beautiful phone. That's what it really is. It fits the latest trend of making a weird green phone, which is the hottest craze. So this is going to be a beautiful phone. We now have SD card support. I maybe should have researched all these good technologies before building the Crapple 1 and the Crapple 2. <laughs> Fans of this company are eating good, though, because we're putting out a new phone every month. Every month there's a new Crapple device for you. Oh, our fans are growing. Our fans are growing. 
Look at our fan base go. Hype for the crapple too has never been higher. Ordinary, bad, very bad. Crapple 2 does not have any of the configurations that beautiful phones should have. Jerks. It looks exactly like the market wants. My, I don't understand. My market research clearly indicated I should make something that looked terrible. When has market research ever been wrong? I'm just trying to pander to the biggest demographic possible that has never backfired in any industry for any product ever. All right, come on, give me my fans. Give me my last fans, please. Am I gonna get the fans before I'm out of a... Uh, I might need to make... <laughs> we might need to make another crapple real quick. Hang on. The crapple three, it'll have a... Uh, what do we have now? What is our new research? SD card support and battery. Having a new battery, ear, earphone jack, earphone, earphone jack. No waterproof, not happening. Keep dreaming. 480p screen, I don't know. Supper energy. Rugged phone, I guess. Camera phone. Media phone, gaming phone. None of these is how I would describe my phone. There's no like budget crap option. <laughs> Let's do flagship. This is my flagship phone. I need 80 fans in 44 days or the company is going bankrupt. Come on people, become fans of Crapple. We gotta get some venture capital funding. Somebody put AI in it, hurry. Put AI in the phone. If the Crapple phone has AI, it'll sell real good. Yeah, I didn't customize the look because the other look is still selling well, apparently. Apparently it's still trending. Crapple 2 sold out. We sold 1,800 of them. It's gonna, it's gonna be valuable. I should start my own niche electronics company, buy my entire supply from myself, and in 20 years, sell it to people who are nostalgic. The only possible issue is they won't be nostalgic for a product they never had <laughs> because I bought the whole supply. If we can overcome that minor fault, though. Terrible bad ordinary, come on, guys. Uh, Crapple fans beg to differ. The critics got this one wrong. The Metacritic speaks for itself. There we go. Get award. Choose an award. It's roguelike? What the heck? Oh my god. Voluntary <laughs> overtime? Yeah, voluntary overtime for sure. I thought that would save my company from bankruptcy, but all that did was give me... I can now tie the employees to the chair and force them to work. Decorate. Let's decorate. We gotta improve morale around here. Decorate. That's it. Good news, guys. We're buying new floors. Loans. Can I get a loan? How do I get loans and investments? I'm looking for a loan. I just go into severe debt now, insufficient funds. All right, the Crapple 3 is selling decently. Number of duck decorations reach one of one. I mean, how do I get a decoration? I feel like I have one now, right? I decorated the floor. Can I buy, do I buy a new one? Game saved, uh oh. Items in the store have been refreshed. I definitely added a decoration. There it is. I don't know what button confirms it, though. So I guess I'll never get that award. Bankrupted. The company went bankrupt. But don't be discouraged. 
During this entrepreneurial phase, the company accumulated a lot of research points that we can be purchased and upgraded the main menu. Make the company stronger. And we can select three from the current employees. Oh, it is roguelike. What the heck? It's a roguelike business sim? The heck? Gary Rasmussen, Dennis, or Jerry Mills? I mean, we want them again. <laughs> Let's start a new company. Let's start a new company that has all the same problems as before. How many neutrons do I have? I can buy a sales increase. There we go. I sent my neutrons on a sales increase. I have two left. They should keep this Marble Blast Ultra sound of music playing the whole time. This music is way better than the music they have in the actual game. All right, now I know the game. Now I have a 2% sales boost. So now, AI, tech, future, zone, company. This company will win for sure. The <laughs> leanest tech company to ever exist. Mm -hmm. We're in the same office. Oh yeah, Crapple? No, Crapple shut down. Crapple was going nowhere. Don't worry though, we have a new plan. We're gonna start researching hardware. I should be able to keep the hardware I researched, right? Maybe I can. Oh, we have like no funding. It's the entrepreneurial phase, guys. Gamifying like a Silicon Valley startup cycle as a roguelike, is, that's pretty funny. That is pretty good. It's I don't know. If, that's definitely not like intentional, but that's pretty good actually. The constant churn of failed startups is equivalent to a roguelike game. We need a new employee. How do I hire someone? Why is it locked? Because to get my bonus, I need new employees. Are we researching anything? End goal to get featured on Tech This Out. Yeah, the new Crapple phone is coming sooner than you think. I guess we're gonna make a phone. All right, this time what's popular is a cube phone. But you know what? I'm gonna go off the script. I'm not gonna play by society's rules the elongated phone. Let's just make an iPad and call it a phone. Give it some curvature, gotta have curvature, gotta have border roundness, gotta have middle frame roundness. Arbitrarily place the camera, have a disgusting camera container. Max the smoothness on that bad boy. Put it right there. Max the Ben. Ben goes in the circle, of course. Colors is the most important, so we'll go red. Then we'll go blue. And for power, we gotta go yellow. Then for volume, we go green. Back cover, uh, it's gotta be purple. Don't have any orange yet. What am I missing? Red, orange, yellow, blue, indigo, violet, I guess an indigo color. Perfect, the clown phone. When Apple released that one long phone is when I switched to HTC. Yeah, I don't want my phone to be long. I've needed a new phone. Well, you know, you don't, you don't really need anything really. Needing a new phone is not something that is an actual concern. But anyways, I've needed a new phone for a while because my phone doesn't hold battery for more than a couple hours now. But like, I look at all the phones that are available. I'm like, these all suck. I hate these. They're like, good news, everybody. The screen is super big now. 
and it costs hundreds of millions of dollars. And I'm like, can you make it? Can you make the screen small? And then it can cost ten dollars. Would be a good phone. That'd be kind of cool, I think. Anyways, this is our new AI phone. This this is gonna be called Phone GPT. Slogan: Made for enthusiasts. Phone type: Camera phone. Let's do it. I have a Pixel 7 C foam. Oh, you have the C foam phone. You're the person that that market trend was based on. I thought it was rather outlandish, but no. I mean, the color doesn't really matter because you're just going to put a case on it anyway. But it's it's nice to have the color underneath that you, you know it's there. You're like, yeah, I know. I know my phone looks cool. The research for processor Snapdragon has been completed, okay. It's gonna take a lot of grinding and failing and purchasing incremental upgrades of neutrons to get anywhere in this, I feel. Dennis Reed has improved though, thanks Dennis. My case is clear, oh did it come with a clear case? If it comes with a clear case then that's how you know. My favorite is when the iPhone cases have the circular cutout for the uh, Apple logo. Has the best. Like, yeah, I'm going to put a case on it because I don't trust this thing not to break when it drops. But it is Apple, just so you know. This is the best, most high-end, expensive phone hardware around. And uh, it's too fragile to be practical, so I had to put a case on it. But I, I have the logo. The logo is mine. You won't see me having a green bubble in the iMessage, am I right? I have a lemon grass phone in a full black case, like a bumblebee. I bought the one from Spigen or Spy Gen, Spy Gen, whatever you call it. That is the kind of case I have on my phone right now. It's severely busted up and scraped, but I feel that adds that adds to the character. That adds to the appeal, I think. Yeah, if, you, if you go on Amazon and search for like phone case, the spy gen phone case is like number one all time seller. And I've been using them. I've been using these spy gen cases since my very first iPhone four I had. So they've earned my brand loyalty because they've always been fine for me. I've never had a phone break from dropping. And trust me, I be dropping. May thy phone chip and shatter. I live dangerously. I don't have a case. What are you trying to review the phone? You're trying to take some product photography for your YouTube video? Our phone is selling not bad. Let's make the same one again. Our phone is selling not bad. Let's make the same one again. Come on, AI Tech Future Zone. Why are you guys not developing it? Why are you guys not developing our new phone? Do it. Oh, it's paused. That's why. That'll do it. The camera won't move now. What did I do to make the camera not move? There we go. We're back. We're so back. I think they're a legit solid product. They are a solid product. This video is now sponsored by SpyGen Phone Case. Buy it now at a good price. The company is underfunded. Yeah, I'm aware. We're only underfunded by 342 gold coins, though. Phone GPT sold 9k? Dude. Dude. I'm telling you, dude, AI is the latest thing. I do enjoy the Price is Right font on these numbers. That's very good. All right, while this one's... Just make another one. Make the same phone again. <laughs> just keep making the same phone. Can we really sell the same phone to these people and just put a new number on it? Surely that tactic wouldn't work in real life, right? I would say I haven't broken a screen yet, but that would have big hubris energy. Oh yeah, big hubris. I mean, I haven't broken a screen yet either, so I'm going to today. So it's got prices right font for the numbers. 
but then it's got Paper Mario font for start selling. Let's see, is that one? That one's selling pretty much as good as the other one. Maybe a little less. The first moment I saw AI Tech Future Zone 3, I decided to buy it because it's just so good looking. If the phone had a high quality rear camera, it'd be more fit for camera phone. Users love the newly released phone we gave 500 fans. Oh my God, we're gonna be a successful company actually. I recommend the Pixel 8a. Well, you would say that because you're a Pixel owner. Does anybody own Does anybody own a cell phone they would not recommend? Who Does anyone have a phone that they're like, this sucks, don't buy it? Is that a thing? Not if like you have like an old phone that's like dying. But like if you just bought a phone, you're, you're probably extremely likely just to cope and be like, oh, this is good. I like it. But also most phones are fine these days. Like it's hard to find a phone that's not good. As long as it works, it works. AI Tech Future Zone 3 sold out. That was not as good as the other one. We gotta increase our screen size, I think. That's, the, that's holding us back. There we go. I don't know how to do it. Future Zone 4 coming out soon. Had a Windows Lumia phone? Yeah, don't have a Windows phone. Even if Windows phones were actually good, even if live tiles were a good idea for a phone, I still hate them because of their association with Windows 8. If I see the Windows phone, like home screen, I'm like, ah, Windows 8, oh God. Bad vibes on that brand. Unlike Zune, Zune had good vibes, dude, I miss Zune. They should make Zune phones. New popular appearance for phones? Is it based off is it based off mine? No, it's like red with lime green buttons. That's dumb. Who's gonna buy that? We here at AI Tech Future Zone think that's not the future. The future is clearly The future is clearly uh that color. The first ever future zone phone to come in vomit green. Bought a cheap off brand Android on Amazon, it sucked. Well, what brand was it so I don't buy it? The Galaxy S4 was garbage when I first got it years ago. Hmm. So don't buy a Galaxy S4. <laughs> what are they all like Galaxy S20 now? Market research shows that it was so similar, users didn't buy it. Oh, well, it was the same. It was literally the same phone. That might be an issue. <laughs> it was so similar to the other phone, insofar as it was the same exact phone again. The annual awards conference saw who wins. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the 2014 annual mobile phone awards ceremony. Wow. The best performing phone is the G2. The best looking phone is the Mi 3. The best camera is the 010. The best value is the Uphone 5S. The worst phone is the X... Oh, we didn't get worst phone? The best phone of the year is G2. Now nah, we didn't win an award. Now innovate by removing features. Sure, I should remove the RAM. I think if I remove the memory from my phone, it'll be faster, right? It'll have less crap clogging up the works as you will. All right, can I hire an employee yet? It still looks locked. Three hundred thousand coins for an employee. That's too many coins. I can't afford that. I'm not rich. Okay, we gotta we gotta research some more hardware because the AI Tech Future Zone. Can we even research any hardware at all? We can't. Good time to start a new phone. I'm kind of liking the candy bar aesthetic. 
Oh, maybe I make it the same. Oh, dude, Mr. Beast. It's the Mr. Beast chocolate bar. Yes. The Feastables phone, officially licensed by Jimmy Beast. I started my own mobile phone company. You can buy my phone at any Walmart in the USA. Buy my mobile phone, Jimmy Beast phone. I challenge 500 people to use my new Mr. Beast phone. Mr. Beast phone AI. And it is going to be a rugged phone. And let's try to upgrade the hardware. Ooh, we're going to upgrade. Ooh, 512 megabytes of memory. Ooh, baby. HP pavilion moment. Oh, man. A gateway moment. Do I have any more features I can advertise? We're still 480p screen. Yeah, that's pretty much all we got. All right, Mr. Beast. We're going to, going to go with brand recognition. Hopefully it's good. I've been living off caffeine the last few months. How bad is caffeine quitting cold turkey? It's not pleasant. Probably it takes it takes me like if I don't have caffeine, it takes like two or three days for it to get like out of my system, then I'm good. But for those days I'm like, oh my god, I'm so tired. This sucks. Where's caffeine man? And that's why you just drink caffeine. That's why you give in. That's why you give in to the addiction. I'm sure the same was said about Marbolo lights. It's paused? Oh, it is paused. You're right. All right, Mr. Beast. Start the R&D. Just give in. Yeah, just give in. It's fine. Can't wait for in like 300 years and they're like, oh my god, they drank that? They ate that crap? Did you know that in the Fallen Kingdom... Once known as the United States of America, all their bread was just sugar. You couldn't even buy bread in that place. Literally all the bread was just sugar in a bag. And it was delicious. It was really good. All right, Mr. Beast, come on. Sell my phone good. I'm tired of being tired and thirsty. Yeah, drink that five-hour energy energy. They should just call it five-hour energy energy. That'd be good. That would amuse me greatly. Our debt is decreasing. They drank lab chemicals called energy drinks. There was this stuff called aspartame that they would willingly ingest. That ended their lives at an alarming rate. Mr. Beast phone sold 4K. Okay, not bad. Not bad for Mr. Beast phone. Couldn't be Jimmy. Not precious Jimmy. All right, we don't have any fun. We still have negative hundreds of thousands of dollars, so we're not going to be able to research anything new. We think the chemicals had some sort of religious significance due to the frequency of their consumption. Let's go. Let's make a Game Boy. How about that? Let's make a Game Boy Color. Uh, where's the stupid camera thing? Want that camera thing out of here? Actually, that should be the slot, right? The camera thing should be the slot. So I do want one, but I want the shape to be like that. Is there a color thing for this? Where's the Game Boy camera? Middle frame. Uh, what color Game Boy color did you have? Let me know in the comments. My Game Boy color was the lime green Game Boy color. Not very metallic at all. It was more of that shade. It was more saturated than that, though. More of a bright neon green. 
A little lighter than that. More yellow than that, actually. More of a that shade. Pikachu yellow, clear blue. Oh, the clear ones are so awesome. They gotta bring back clear controllers, man. Clear controllers are very good. I don't know why they got rid of them. No, you can see all the gizmos. It'll run the magic. Red Game Boy Color. Teal? I didn't know they had a teal one. Teal sounds ideal. I'm a teal fan. All right, now we go back to shape. The screen position has to be... Can I make the screen smaller? Well, if the screen can't be smaller, it has to be... Oh, the screen just increases. Okay, fine. Would love a clear switch. Oh, a clear switch would be cool. They won't do that because the base unit's the same for all of them, I think. But clear switch Joy-Cons? That'd be good. That'd be a cool thing to own. Although at this point, just wait for Switch 2 to come out and actually fix a drift. <laughs> it's not going to do that. If anything, they'll make the drift worse on purpose, and the controllers now cost $100. Game Boy Color. Let's do it. This will sell out of the shelves for sure. Am I a bad person for never owning a Game Boy? No. I'm going to go with no on that one. I don't think Game Boy has any sort of karmic effect. I could be wrong. You die and you go to heaven. Uh, yeah, it looks like, uh, let's see, you had the Lime one? Hmm, sorry. We only, uh, we only let Pokemon Game Boys in here. Are you sure you didn't have, like, a Bulbasaur green? No, it was just lime? Okay, well, sorry. Can't come in. All right, well, we did pretty good. My designers are getting better and better. I can use Neutrons to buy a 10% sales increase again. I can express my wish that this menu music be played for the entire game, and then I can stop playing because I... How do you even make progress in this? It's possible that you can, and I'm just very bad at it, but it feels to me like you gotta grind your guys up through several cycles before you can even like do anything. No thanks. <laughs>